Hey and welcome folks, Mark Rolton coming to you live. But I often get the question from new budding investors and, and people, you know, highly sophisticated people, high net worths, all asking, you have this trend by which you invest all over the country. Can you give us some deeper explanation as to why you do that? Well, you and I both know the market is driven by demand. Supply demand, that's all that occurs in a market. That's the reason that markets rally. If you want it more than what I do, you will pay more. If I want it more than you do, however, I will pay more. And we have this ratcheting effect or an ascending process of a market. Now, when you think about where demand begins, it always begins in Sydney. With occupants of just over 5.4 million Greater New South Wales, naturally demand is higher there, which fuels the fire of a market rising quickly. Naturally, the second location you're going to get the greatest demand is Melbourne. But we're both seeing, sorry, we're seeing both of these cities right now starting to level out and peter sideways. So why then are you so heavily focused on Brisbane? Well, with its 1.86 million occupants, it's Australia's third largest city. And naturally, it's in, next in line for that momentum. When you look at demand supply, we're seeing massive amounts of capital flying towards the northern parts or the northern regions of Australia. Southeast Queensland is the fastest growing region on the continent. Do the maths. 82,500 families call Brisbane, Greater Southeast Queensland, home every single year. Now, an interesting statistic is for every family that moves to Southeast Queensland, it creates 1.1 new jobs. Whether that be in services, family services, schooling, teachers, government bodies, it's creating jobs as well. So one of the, the, the foremost reasons is to follow where the market moves next based on supply and demand. That's naturally Queensland. And some of the real precursors are the fastest growing region in the country. Secondly, it's got the lowest corporate tax regime in Australia, meaning the Queensland government set out many years ago to attract business, whether it be manufacturing, logistics, services, IT, education. Australia has Queensland as its employment hub. Unemployment, even on the back of the mining demise, now that mining's really come off and it's in a slump, unemployment in, in Queensland is still around 5.6%. That means 94 people today have a full-time job here and only 5, 5.5% of people actually don't. So these are the real drivers as to why I'm here spending just over $190 million on a new trophy project. I hope that feeds some insight. I really hope that that sort of resonates with you. you know, the kind of wisdom that's on display here you know, is really now a testament of why Massland has been going for over a decade now and producing millionaires alike from real estate and investing in themselves and property. If you haven't learned that process, it's called an automatic acquisition plan. An automated approach to investing that allows property to do the heavy lifting. The way you and I buy two properties each single year, over a 10 year window, two properties by 10 years is 20 properties or 20 keys as we call it internally. At the end of that 10 year window, we know that at least half of our portfolio has essentially doubled. Property typically doubles seven to 10 years. In the last four years, we've seen it more than double in New South Wales and that trend moving north to the likes of Queensland. That, 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 that period, that time frame, that window is happening faster today than it ever has. But at the end of 10 years, our portfolio has essentially doubled. We're selling down the 10 older properties that are a little bit harder to rent, costing a little bit more in maintenance, a little bit harder to find the tenants. And now we're using those profits to pay out the debt on the 10 newer properties we intend to keep for the long haul. If you need further understanding, further description, or you know, more understanding of how the process works, for goodness sakes, pick up the telephone, talk to my team, and get moving now. Projects like this are skyrocketing. It's time that you made the money that you deserve. Mark Rolton signing off. Have a great afternoon. Bye for now.